Local baller Negro made the mistake of trying to slip a fastball by Willie Stargell. And Stargell crushed it to put the Bucks ahead 2-0. that in your day. No, you're right. Two balls, two strikes again on Stargell. <laughs> Willie leading off in the bottom of the second, no score. <laughs> Hit in the air to deep center field. Bunbury going back, all the way back at the fence. Gone. He can hit it out anywhere. So the great man comes through and gives the Bucks an early lead, his second home run of the World Series. Dead center field, about 410 feet on the fly. Batted in on that roller. He struck him out again, swinging in the center. seen so much up tonight. Hit well, right field. Singleton to the wall, and this ball is gone. Willie Stargell, the big man. Seven times he had come to the plate in this series with runners in scoring position and fell. But suddenly, and we said this would be a testing inning for the young southpaw, suddenly with one swing in the race in the wake of Robinson's bad hop single, turns it around for the moment. Now the Pirates, they're a happy bunch. As they greet the old pro, Willie Stargell. And in the seventh game, with the chips on the line, Stargell is three for three as you look. But most valuable Willie Stargell, National League co-MVP, Championship Series MVP, and now World Series MVP at age 38. The oldest man to be so honored. Of his 12 hits, seven went for extra bases, a series record. Awesome numbers for an awesome man. Willie Stargell brings his clan home to Pittsburgh. <laughs> 